Are we going to my uncle now? That's what's happening. It's Garrett! It is me! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew survived! Oh, yay. Uncle. <sighs> oh, God. <laughs> Garrett! I was too late. They were already dead. Oh. Bring the maester. Meet us in the Great Hall. Quickly! Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? For pigs. My sister, she. Oh, God. She was only eight years old. What? That was eight? No this way. never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Mister. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? No, oh, don't. <laughs> oh, he's shuck. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> that no. Don't close it back up. Dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the what eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. <sighs> Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Roderick and Lord Forrester. We can avenge them. And attack House Frey. Now is the time to find allies, not enemies. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands talks. now. Although he is young. And altogether unprepared to lead. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first, to see if you can put any weight on that leg. Oh, good as new. Maggots and Go all. On. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. <sighs> Let's go uh, take a look at that beautiful painting. Oh, sorry, tapestry. So, who do we have here? We have Mira, Lady Forrester, R Ryan, Lord Forrester, Roderick. Okay, so those two are gone. Uh, Talia and Ethan. Ethan is the one who's leading, right? And then there's Asher. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Okay, uh, Lady Forrester and... Mira. Mira. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Hmm. You seem to be favouring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Maestro Tengren. Look, I'll show you. <laughs> yeah, you show him. Well, um, I lost my father, I lost my sister, I lost my lord, I lost the, the lord's son. Um, so pretty much now I... Uh, and I almost lost my leg, yeah, forgot about that. So I think things are going absolutely amazing, actually. I'm still alive, so... You know, fuck everyone else. Did your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Garrod. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrod... I heard what happened. Oh. <clears throat> Is it true? Your family... Sorry. Um, also, which one is my uncle? Was this so my uncle? Sorry. I don't think so. Because that's the maester. Though we do seem Off to... Off to bed now. Like... Hurry on. I would have called him uncle, you know? 
right? Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. He saved my life, my lady. Yet not Roderick's. Oh, damn. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. I'm sorry, my lady. Nothing could be done to save him. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told... I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last uh... words before he passed? If you can remember. It would mean so much to the family. He said he loved you. That's oh. very kind of you to say. Okay. You have the good. Forester's sword. Oh, shit, no. Ethan should have it, now that he is Lord. <clears throat> Lord Forrester asked me to return it to the house. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Did he say that? Thank or you. did he say something about my Garrett. uncle? I keep of course, my lady. Messing up. They demand a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our strength. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people. Your family. You're our family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They killed my family. And they'll pay for what they've done. That much, I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. It's not now. When? We have <clears throat> to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. It was his family they killed. So what's to be done? I tried responding. It's just a quick. <sighs> Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house. And he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. But I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. I'd have done the same, as any man would. It wasn't murder. It was justice. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why you cannot stay. Oh, cannot dear. stay? Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. But, but where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even House Bolton. You're sending him to the wall? I'm going to the, the wall? He's done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. I'm afraid it's the only solution, especially now, when the house is oh, so fuck vulnerable. Okay, I'll go. I'll do what's best for the house. Yeah. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. It's not like I have it any family fair, left. But it is what's best. <clears throat> to the wall. That settles it then. Ah. <clears throat> Word up to me. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given a chance. I oh. would. And God's willing, someday I will. Oh. But for now, I have House Forrester oh. to consider Look at first. The size, though. <laughs> Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. You're the only family I have left. Oh, you're my uncle. In my heart, I know I'll see you again. 
Oh, I've been waiting that. for the right moment to tell ah, you. Yes, you are my uncle. Okay, listen. What? What is it? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, the North Grove can never be lost. I don't know what it means. Sorry. Yeah! You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. What is the North Grove? Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools. And it's better <clears throat> kept that way. You haven't told anyone else, have you? Nope. Zip. This is important, Garrett. I need to know the truth. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. Yes. From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. But I can't say anything more just yet. Just Ugh. know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger okay. if you can. <clears throat> it will help. Ranger, like like the arrows. Like, pew, pew, pew. I like that. <sighs> <laughs> oh, this Iron from satisfied ice. I look. Iron from ice. Ooh. Iron Remember, from ice. You represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll make I will you make proud. you proud, Uncle. Because you already have. Oh. Oh. Shucks. <laughs> Oh god, Harris is gonna cry because I'm leaving. Oh, Jared, wait! Oh. Be like, mm, no, thank you. <laughs> That's nice. Be safe. Thank you. I'll try. Say oh. lovey. Ethan! It's a nice forest. Ethan is being a little fuck. And he's also a lord now, so Jeez. <laughs> I couldn't find him. Could you? He hides too well. And if he were smart, he would reveal himself. Yeah. I don't like this game anymore. It's called hide and Maybe seek. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten this is a game. Aww. You found me. Aww. Well done, Ryan. That's a good guy. Don't worry. It's just a game, Ryan. A stupid exactly. Game. Don't, don't like be a it. stupid child. He was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you again. I'm Aww. right here, and I <clears> promise <throat> I'm not going anywhere. Oh. That's uh, that's that here. that and literally that means that he's gonna die. And, and Roderick, I do too. But Mira's in King's Landing, and can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Oh, jeez. Ryan, she's perfectly safe. I promise you. I don't want Gareth to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. Yep, unfortunately. I'll miss Gareth. He was nice. Garrett is I don't know smart. What he did to get sent away like that. He'll be fine. Garrett is smart. No one will tell me what Garrett did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Royland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Oh. Everyone's worried about you, but <clears throat> I'm not. I know you'll protect us. Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Royland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? Duh! And That's true. Look at your arms. Up. Sir Royland forgets himself. After all, you are the lord of the house now. He yeah. doesn't know me or, or what I'm capable of. Yeah. What does Miltsop mean? I don't know, but I know it's not good. Ethan, <laughs> you should let Sir Royland teach you how to wield a sword <coughs> like, <clears throat> like a man. He taught Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to fight. 
Jesus Christ, does everyone know how to fight except me? <laughs> Do you remember yeah. when we were younger? When we all used to play here? You, me, Roderick. That's, that's some Asher. big ass tree now that I think about it. We'd all be out here for hours. Yeah. Where was I? You weren't born yet. <laughs> we had so much fun. But then well then everything changed. Roderick became so serious, the Lord in training, and he never smiled anymore. And Asha Asha just got angry at everything. Promise me you won't be like that. Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. Yeah. I know a lord has many responsibilities, but you don't need to be like them. I may have to change. You have That's to change. Just I'd rather have my is. brother than a lord. You'll have to have both, I'm afraid. Exactly. You know? But it's a beautiful place. I really like lord. it. You can do anything you want. I suppose. Everyone will have to do as you say. So I could have all the sweets I want. I, I kind of knew he was going to say that. Simple. It would be nice if someone did what I wanted for once. But Ethan will be a good lord. A proper lord. As many as you'd like, <laughs> yes. Really? Of course. Just shit on Why her. Not? <laughs> <laughs> lord Ethan, you're needed in the great hall at once. Quickly, on your feet. Yep. That sucks. You know, it's just like that. One day your dad dies and you become a lord What's and the matter? stop being a child. Lord Whitehill has arrived. Unannounced and certainly unexpected. Oh, shit. He's come demanding justice. Oh, no. Can't he meet with Duncan? He is the Castellan. Stay with us. Please, Ethan. He's demanding an audience with the lord. We really must go. No. It's your decision. You are the lord. If I were lord... I would command Ethan to stay, with his family. Lord Whitehill is a mean old man anyways. I might remind you, Sir Royland, I'm the new Lord of House Forrester, not you. Of course, my lord. It's okay. You should go. It's what must be done. Okay. Fine. Let's be done with it. Oh, damn, 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 damn. I'm literally just a child. I cannot be more than 14 years old. If even that. Oh, they showed up unannounced. Lord Whitehill is in a lather. I assume you explained to Lord Ethan why they're here. The business with Garrett. I told him. Lord Whitehill knows Garrett is a squire to this house. Or was, I suppose. Is, was, it makes no difference. The White Hills were clearly in the wrong, so don't give him any satisfaction. Out there, you said you were the Lord. Now prove it. Okay. Let's not do something rash. Things are bad enough as it is. I can handle Lord Whitehill. It's well okay. said, my Lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already is. He's got five times as many men, and the backing of House Bolton. All the more reason to stand up for ourselves. Only cowards and dead men roll over. Okay, okay. <sighs> so be strong, but not too strong, firm, but uh, just say. Uh, firm enough. That's a fat guy. Lord Ethan, is it? Not fat My condolences shaming. for your father just, and brother. You know, say. The late Lord Forrester was no friend to me or my house, but to his family it's still a loss. My only regret is I wasn't there to drive the dagger into his heart myself. Wow. I've been waiting for this day all my life. The Foresters finally get their due. How dare you? I dare, and I'll do as I damn well please. Nope. And no bread and salt! What kind of fucking house receives a lord with no fucking bread and salt? You bloody amateur. Wow. No courtesies. I should have expected as much. Bloody foresters. Calm yourself, old man. Oh, hoo, 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 hoo. You little fuck! That's how you talk to a lord. You, you foresters you fuck have off. shit on us for generations. Well, now the Starks are no longer around to have your back, are they? 
Oh, don't We're come back. We're the power in the North now. Roose Bolton is the Warden of the <clears> North. <throat> Aye, and we've been his bannermen for five fucking centuries, you cunt. Lord Ethan, you're losing control of this. We all serve House Bolton now. I'm not finished. Maybe if you hadn't been so fucking greedy with the ironwood, things would have been different between us. You squandered your share. Our share was taken from us. We had no fucking choice but to harvest what was left. What I is see. it you want, Lord Whitehill? Exactly. Ugh. Jeez. Your man, the squire. We were minding our own business, <laughs> keeping the king's peace, Fucker. as his lordship here said. When your man attacked us for no reason. Uh -huh. Hear that? Attack for no reason. That's not how it happened. And you admit it was your man who killed my men. And a pig farmer at that. How do you answer for your squire, Lord Ethan? He acted in your name. And you are the lord of this house. We lost people too, Lord Whitehill. Your men murdered his entire family. Exactly. You lost pig farmers, not soldiers. What? Soldiers worth a hundred of their type. Where's the fucking coward who killed my men? I know he's here. What have you done with him? He was sent to the wall. Exactly. Who the fuck sent him to the wall? <laughs> we sent him. Answer me. Who's the one who did it? I did. I did it. What? That was my justice to deliver, boy. And you denied me of it. Yeah. I'm not leaving so until what? I have my justice. Now bring me the coward who did it, or you'll answer to Roos Bolton. What kind of fucking house is this? A house of honorable men. Oh, yeah. Strong female you bellow protagonist. You like wounded boar, Lord Whitehill. Have you forgotten your manners? I mean no disrespect to you, my lady. Considering your losses and all, but this, this is not over. It's over when my son says it is. Thank you for coming, Lord Whitehill. Ethan is Lord of Ironrath now. By rights, his word is law here. If that displeases you, hmm. then I trust you can find the door. And don't let it hit you on the way out. That lad may be Lord of this house. But Lord Bolton will have the final say. I'll send him a raven letting him know a forester man killed one of his own. That the new Lord Forester lied to my face and denied me my justice. What? Then we'll You're see whose lie. word is law. Do your worst, you bastard. I, I guess I didn't say anything. I wanted to say, like, do as you like, but, you know. Silence is fine as well, I guess. Oh, God. A heavy burden, You must indeed. find your voice, my lord. Your enemies will interpret your silence as a sign of weakness. Oh. You were brave, I, oh. my son. <laughs> but you'll need to be braver still when Ramsay Snow arrives to see you bend the knee. Prepare a raven. We need to send word to Mira in King's Landing at once. <sighs> tough, tough crowd. What if I go stronger? What if I get higher? What if I start doing things I know I will regret? I will make my own way. I will not surrender. I will do my best until I get put under. What if I go stronger? 